Jeremy Lair, the chairman and CEO of Brightcove. And um, you know, in the talk today, I really tried to touch on a few things. I think one was just looking at the continued rapid growth in online video viewing, the scale of that, the growth rates, and some of the key growth drivers. And, and some of those drivers are that you know, ad-supported online video continues to grow rapidly, faster than any other area of online advertising. Um, and, and really critically, the, the marketing and retail applications of video are really exploding. And so one of the really exciting things is that corporations, uh, institutions are really expanding and investing in video as a way to enhance their customer relationships and customer touch points. So that was really one, I think, big theme. I think um, the other really big theme that I wanted to focus on was this continuing fragmentation and complexity that's emerged uh, in online video. We've moved from the world of people publishing video to the PC web with Flash to needing to have uh, you know, video on tablets and smartphones, both web browsing and native apps that people do across lots of different platforms. And the emergence of connected TVs is yet another uh, set of platforms that are going to create these challenges for people publishing. And, um, and then the explosion in, in social media sites as sources of traffic and of valuable forms of customer engagement. And so really the world has changed a lot in the last 12 months and that's actually created a huge amount of challenges and a huge amount of opportunities. And I really wanted to highlight those and, and then show how you know, cutting edge publishers are really embracing that and doing really compelling things with it and making it material uh, to their business and, and business goals. And so those are, the, I think, the big themes. And, um, and I think you know, really big picture, you know, we're, we're just at the beginning. Um, the video ubiquity is just emerging. And, and we see a world in the next several years where every professional website in the world is going to have professional video applications. And so it's a very exciting time uh, for our company and, and in the industry. And could you just tell us a little bit of what's exciting about Brightcove 5 and what do you find exciting? where we're at now in the space. Sure, you know, I think you know, Brightcove 5 is a great release. Um, you know, touches on, in fact, many of the themes that, that we talked about today. You know, uh, expanding all the, the platforms that people are getting to, you know, high quality templates for things like iPad video applications, high quality streaming for iOS devices. Um, you know, uh, what we call smart players, which are um, you know, cross-platform that will provide the exact same kind of player experience uh, across both HTML5 and Flash and automatically do that for users. So really making it simpler for people. Um, you know, new, new, uh, completely expanded new suite of analytics that go a lot deeper in terms of the insights that people get and do that also both across the HTML5 uh, video internet and the Flash video uh, world. And, and you know, these touch points in social media distribution, we launched YouTube Sync as a really core feature for our customers, which is really great. YouTube's a really important part of how content gets discovered, how video gets discovered. And so w whether you're a marketer or a media company, being able to synchronize the content you want on YouTube as a source of traffic is, is also, uh, you know, also a big deal. So th those are some of the things that you know, I'm excited about in, uh, in the Breakup 5 release. And the, the post you wrote in TechCrunch earlier in the year, have we seen much change since then? Um, we really haven't. I mean, I think we're just seeing those those uh, platform wars kind of continue to play out, and um, you know that's created a lot of work for us. But uh, by us doing that work, we're making it much easier for for everyone else, and so um, we're turning that into an opportunity. Very good. Thanks for your time, Jeremy. Thanks, Larry.